Hello party people. I'm at Costco right now. This is not a shop with me, but I was just here a few days ago and I saw, whoopsie, I always leave something on. Hopefully this time it's not the whole car. Oh my God. You guys, I'm wearing this maternity dress that I haven't worn since I was pregnant with Wentworth. Can you just peek on how short it is? I'm constantly like pulling it down. Let's not even discuss the fact that I have not shaved my legs in two weeks. Uh, it's not even winter. I would show you a close up of my leg hair, but like no one wants to see that. You guys might want to see this though. What? Check the holes with boughs of holly. Are you kidding me? These weren't out when I came a few days ago. These Christmas trees. They're so beautiful. They're just making me so happy. But the real reason I came was for three things that I forgot. <gasps> I smell cookies. They're baking cookies. Mm. Sample, I hope. I forgot to pick up some chicken drumsticks for a recipe. Oh gosh, it's heavy. But mostly this. You guys, I have not stopped thinking about this since I came to Costco. This is like the best soup ever. I fully regretted not buying it, so I'm back for it. You can't have soup without some really good crusty bread. I haven't tried this before, but it looks promising. It's bread, how can it be bad? Oh my word, they're tempting me. They have all the Christmas candies out. Stroop waffles! I smell cookies so hardcore right now, but they don't have any samples out. So I'm pretty sure they're probably just making muffins or something. And also, pretty sure this dress shrunk. We're gonna go with that, it shrunk. It's not me, it's the dress. Hello there, it's been like a week since I filmed. Update, I have shaped my legs, I think, maybe. It's possible, <laughs> I don't know. Really, it has no bearing on your life, so you'll be just fine. I am headed out the door. I should probably grab my list. My list isn't very comprehensive, so I'm just gonna leave it at home. Don't let me forget to grab my grocery bags. Um, so, a bunch has kind of happened this week. Where are my shoes? And this is the first time I'm wearing like, I mean, I'm still wearing sandals, but I kind of broke my toe. I'm falling apart, guys. It's still a little tight. I broke my toe like a week ago and eh, it's looking a lot better. That was a real big close up of my foot. Don't look at it. Oh, it still hurts to walk. I don't know if I can wear these. I'm gonna grab my grocery bags before I forget. I also have this bag of returns. Can't forget, I almost forgot it just now. <laughs> I changed my shoes, but oh man, it hurts. P.S. I wasn't doing anything cool when I broke my little pinky teeny tiny toe. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know, but I stubbed my, it's just so stupid. I stubbed my toe on Wentworth's bed and then when I thought it was healing enough for me to like walk on it without a limp two days later, I stubbed it again. The pain I can't express. Oh, it was rough, but it's like fine. It's just like a pinky, it's more annoying than anything else, you know? Uh, okay, so what are we doing today? Good question. What are we doing? <laughs> I need to run to Costco. I wanna get together my nurse gifts. I, they, they have muffin mixes on sale at Target and I also just like to gather some like school snacks for the kids at Target. I feel like Target has a good array of like snacks. I will be prepping some food later, maybe. I, we'll see how the day progresses, but for now, should we go to Target first and then Costco? Let's just go to Target, because if they have like stuff I can get for nurses' gifts, let's just do it. Okay, hi. Why didn't you tell me about this? This? Has <laughs> that been there the whole time? I mean, I assume so. Whatever, guys. You're supposed to tell me when crap like that is on my face. <laughs> I'm officially in my happy place, and they have the Halloween stuff stocked. Let's see if they have anything new here, though. Look at these fall-inspired bath bombs. Cute. Look at this, this is only $3. I feel like that's really nice. I have everything else here too. Pumpkins galore. I haven't bought an eyebrow, anything, in years. I usually use e.l.f., but I'm gonna try this out. I'm also gonna try this. I'm still looking for a dupe for the Revlon like crayon balm that they discontinued. It's breaking my heart for real. I came here like two weeks ago for some fall tissues. 
think I'm gonna go with this box. Perfect. Keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. It's hard. Look how stinking adorable those little plants are. They're $13, what? I'm just loving all the fall stuff. Look at these little scrubby sponges. Those look fun. You know what's even more fun? The Halloween stuff. Oh my gosh, have you guys seen all this stuff yet? Look at this guy, what does he do? Nothing. <laughs> oh my gosh, but look at this skeleton DJ. Amazing. Oh, I'm loving all of it. Look at these cute dudes. Hey. Oh my gosh, out of candy sign. Loving this so much. I'm kind of really into this pumpkin dude, so we're gonna see what he does. <gasps> oh, he's nice. I love him even more, holy crap. Do you guys do booze? I guess this is like a newer thing. You've been booed and you leave treats for your neighbors and stuff. We have yet to do it. Maybe our neighbors don't like us. I don't know. <laughs> I'm now in the baby aisle, which is one of the last things I need for my like hospital bag packing, hence the nurse gifts that I need to pack, but also one onesie, like a going home outfit. You guys, I'm putting way too much pressure on myself about this, but like, where are all of the onesies? Where you at? Holy crap though, what? This is the cutest thing ever. I need it to be two things, and that is long sleeve and gender neutral. But all of the little packs I see are short sleeve or like, come on, if I have a girl, she's gonna be wearing a lot of blue if I buy that, you know what I mean? I already have a ton of blue. I have a ton of gray too, but again, I would buy this, but it's short sleeve. Come on. These aren't bad, but again, they're short sleeves. Like, how am I gonna put a newborn in short sleeves and then hear everyone tell me how they're cold? You know what I mean? <laughs> I guess the hunt continues. I don't know. Once upon a child, here I come. The cute little Halloween end cap right here, though. Okay, I'm kind of really into this. It's so adorable. I might just get one thing for a girl, one thing for a boy. But I don't know if I love the buttons. Also, this one with the freaking dinosaurs. Are you kidding me? Hard choices right here. Okay, if you're wondering, it's been 20 minutes and I'm still standing here deciding. I really wanna get this one, but the buttons are really putting me off and I found this cute one with the zipper. Stop it, are you kidding me? Right freaking now. This is the cutest thing and it comes with a hat. Oh. Anyone remember Littlefoot? What's that movie, Land Before Time? Tell me you remember it. I'm now at the Dollar Tree. I heard rumors that this was happening. Oh. It's true. The rumors are true. Say what? Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Look, even over here, DIY ornaments. So exciting. I shouldn't be in here. There's literally nothing I need, yet here I am. It's just always so fun in there. We're, I'm gonna run to Costco to get things for the nurse's gifts so we can throw those together. And then we'll go home and make some muffins and date balls and whatever else we have to make before the week begins. Are you kidding? It's the best day ever! It's the tearing of my heart when I'm with you. my mind. Maybe it feels like we're... I will say, I'm not sure how I feel about having my absolute favorite songs on a radio station called Adult Hits. I guess I'm an adult. After 30 minutes of being here, just kidding, I've been here for like two minutes, finally found my Milano's. Also, wondering if the nurses would appreciate Oreos. Instead, we're gonna keep it classy. I'm home now, and you guys, I've been meaning to share this with you. This came in! I thought there would be something cool on the back. This came in, oh my gosh! Do you know what this is? It is my, uh, my plaque. I'll show you if I can get it open. And they don't want anyone getting in this thing. So a few months ago, our channel hit 100,000 subscribers. What? That's a lot of people. <laughs> oh man, this is so cool. Guys, 
Look at this. What? Are you kidding me? This is the coolest. It's a plaque. So if you don't know, YouTube sends you a plaque if you reach 100,000 subscribers. And they also send you a plaque when you reach other milestones too, but I never thought I would reach 100,000 subscribers. It's actually a lot lighter than I thought it would be if I'm being honest. Oh, look how shiny. Where am I gonna put this thing? I don't, I don't even hang up my racing medals. Like, <laughs> oh, look at that. It's like a mirror right there. You guys did this for me. You made this happen. There's no way I could have possibly earned this for myself. I am not 100,000 people. So thank you for hanging out with me and understanding me and my craziness and my humor for what it is and accepting me for me. And I am so thankful that 100,000 of you guys said yes to hanging out with me some more. This is pretty sweet. I'm not gonna lie, Alex has been real excited about opening this up, so maybe he can find a spot in our house for this. All right. Now I guess it's time to, um, well, I was going to do laundry, but you know what I did yesterday? Four loads. I did four loads of laundry yesterday! I'm so over laundry, but I have one lingering load here it's just not calling my name. I don't want to do it. <laughs> uh, so I'm not going to do it. <laughs> what I'm going to do instead is make up some date balls and make some muffins. Did I tell you guys there was a sale at Target on the muffins? They only had one of the box mixes that was on sale. The crusties uh, and it was blueberry. So then I just bought a couple boxes of chocolate chip. For well, why not? I know I can make them from scratch. And I have shared my homemade blueberry muffin recipe with you. It's fantastic. But you know what? Sometimes it's just easier to make things from not scratch. <laughs> also, smallest Costco haul ever. These will be my nurse gifts. There are 15 packs of gum in here. So I'm just going to throw 15 little sacks together. I throw one pack of Milano cookies. Delicious. And then one pack of gum because, uh, I don't know. I would like that. <laughs> Muffin mixes. Oh, and I know you guys are super excited about my tissue box. It's been waiting for you. Oh, right there. Oh, perfect. Love it so much. P.S. I was, wow. I was about to buy another one of these candles. It's the pumpkin spice. Oh my God, it smells so good. I already burned through my cinnamon one. Um, and those candles were on sale today, the smaller version, but they didn't have any left. So grab it while you can, people. All right, let's make some muffins. How many is this supposed to make? Oh, this again, it doesn't tell you. Come on, okay, six servings, two. So it makes 12. Math whiz, can I tell you? The other day, actually the other night, it was like 9 p.m., I was craving pancakes. So I went to YouTube to look for the best pancake recipe or most delicious or whatever the heck it was called. And I made them. But I didn't have buttermilk because you guys know I only we only buy almond milk. So I made them with almond milk. They were the worst pancakes I've ever had in my entire life. And I always make pancakes with almond milk. It just surprised me so much. It was, the letdown was so extreme. I woke up the next morning and made my normal pancakes. <laughs> you guys can't even see my batter over here. Do you care? I'm just following the directions on the back. Four eggs and I ran out of oil. Oh man, I ran out of olive oil too, but I didn't buy any more. You know what? I found in my closet the other day another Christmas item, a Christmas gift that we bought and then ended up giving that person something else. How much do I need? Half a cup. Anyway, it's from Trader Joe's, which, oh my gosh, I need to go there like pronto because they have all of their fall stuff out. I mean, do I really need to go there? No, but do I want to? Sure, why not, you know what I mean? Uh, so do you guys wanna see a shop with me? Trader Joe's, like fall edition? How much of this do I need? One and a half cups. Uh, concentration. What was I talking about before Trader Joe's? Muffins, pancakes, I don't remember. Four eggs. 
A one. Whoa, can't crack an egg with my left hand. Still no shells, so I'm all right. Let's try it again. Left hand coming through. Did it. Oh, I was talking about the Christmas gift that I found that I never gifted someone. So I was like, Merry Christmas, Kim. <laughs> it's a set of olive oil. Do oh, I need a whisk? Should I use a whisk or a spoon? I feel like this spoon doesn't get used that often. Um, anyway, so it's a three pack of olive oil and they're like infused with something. And I thought I could save this as a gift again this year, just think, you know, Sometimes you need a gift for someone last minute and it's nice to just have something on hand. Uh, but then I thought, well, I need olive oil. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, last time I did not use cupcake liners. And I regretted it. Oh man, I just spent forever looking for these cupcake liners. I knew I bought them, I just didn't know where I put them. Guess where they were? The last place I looked. That's the best joke I have, guys, ever. It's the best joke I ever tell. <laughs> P.S. A lot of you guys comment on my like industrial size cupcake tin. I love this thing for multiple reasons, but when we used to have birthday parties and I would make cupcakes, I mean, really I just love cupcakes, so anytime we would have a party I would make cupcakes, but um, oh, one's missing. Hold on, there it is. How did I know that was there? <laughs> um, it's so easy because it makes so many at once. It's amazing. Uh, I got it from Michael's. I don't know, it must have been like $10 maybe? I have no idea. It's been so long. Oh, and my whole spiel about pancakes is that I wanted to like batch make pancakes or waffles or something, but listen, the whole waffle thing with the little mini waffle machine that I bought, love it. Don't get me wrong. However, it takes me forever <laughs> to make waffles because it's one at a time. You know what I mean? That was an oversight. The cuteness factor won me over, but the practicality for a family of almost six is just not there, you know? I need to buy a bigger one. I'm right-handed, I don't know why I'm doing this bad. Oh, see that stringy snot? The stringy snot egg. You still can't see it, it's gross. It, like, did, the egg didn't mix in all the way. Do you guys think this is gonna make 24? Oh gosh, someone's at my door! All right, I'm back. Mm, I knew it was gonna lie to me. It does not make 24, hmm, as a matter of fact. But it does make 22 and that is just plenty. Cool. While those are cooking, you guys, can I share with you what we did to our patio? But don't look in our pool because it's not clean yet. <laughs> so I haven't been out here since they finished. It's beautiful. I mean, it better be for the amount of money that we spent on it, you guys. We redid our patio deck. I will show you some before clips because good lord, it really needed to be done like three years ago when we moved in, and a while ago. Uh, yeah, they have a Gatorade and a boombox. They are prepared for a day of work. The sun's coming up a little bit now. They are already like so much farther along. <laughs> They've been out here for like 20 minutes. <laughs> They've already got so much going on. Alex is out there offering them cookies. <laughs> there he is. Delicious. I said, give them the whole bag. <laughs> and he said, are you crazy? <laughs> you should have left the bag out there. I gotta eat some cookies. Uh, no, you don't. <laughs> you don't need to. Oh, look at that rose. It bloomed. Just for you. I like our deck cleaned out like this. <laughs> uh, so the pavers decided to go into my rose garden and uh, you know, whatever. I only have one rose bush growing anyway. Look at that beauty. But can you just look at the deck? It looked miserable before and 
and well worth the money. I'm so happy that we did it. I mean, I'm not happy that it cost us so much, but <laughs> the final product is amazing. Eleanor, show me the loot you got from grandparents. So heavy. What'd you get? Star fruit. Star fruit! How many are in there? Like 15. 1,500! Maybe 15. I fear our basil is dying, so we need to water that pronto. Don't water the basil. Yep, give it a nice drink of water. They're drinking it, they're drinking it. Is that enough? No, more. Eleanor's a great gardener. Look, it's growing. Look, a flower in there. Look. <laughs> I think that's fake. <laughs> that fake flower. <laughs> Someone just threw it there. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Eleanor said, dun, dun, dun. Okay. We have to wake Wentworth up. He's been sleeping forever. <gasps> <laughs> right finger jumps on green. Right finger, hop, hop, hop in place. P.S. If you're wondering, this is where Alex thinks it's a perfect spot. <gasps> Hilarious. Well, it is time for me to make dinner. Do you guys want to see what dinner is? Because I do. Mostly because I don't really know yet. I do know it will be some kind of chicken drumstick. Because that's what I thought out. All right, here's what I threw together for real. Just carrots and onions, a little bit of oil, salt, and pepper, some chicken drumsticks down here looking real raw. I'm gonna steam some broccoli and then coat it with lemon juice. Oh my gosh, it's my new obsession. And I found this in the freezer for the carbs. I'm pretty sure I bought this when I was like in my first trimester doing online grocery shopping. <laughs> uh, back when they were like buy one, get one free. So I'm just gonna use these up. Well, we didn't do much of anything today, but somehow I'm still tired. <laughs> but I sure did enjoy spending time with you. At least that's one thing we did. We hung out together. But I will see you next time. I hope you enjoyed spending your time with me. If you did, make sure to subscribe. Put a little more of that in your day. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Bye. I, I did a bicycle in the house? Oh, Mom, you love this one. Do your peeps thing about this. Ready? <laughs> hey, right. It works better with a smaller person. Come here. You ready? No more. Get up quick. Ow. Ow. Do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Oh my, Alex! Someone's gonna get hurt. It's all fun and games until somebody gets hurt. If you fall long enough, someone will get hurt. <laughs> I know. <laughs>